Today I'm talking about turpentine.
Today I'm talking about turpentine. I had the question, what do we do with the messy, well, with all the turpentine, the uh, old turpentine? Well, what I do is I pour it in a container like this, let everything settle to the bottom. Top part of it, after all the paint settles to the bottom, the top part you're going to have clear, uh, you're going to have clear gamosol. That's what I use. I use Gamasol because it breaks down the paint faster than some of your other Odalis turpentines. Um, takes about two or three days. It'll. Uh, I have a couple of different jars just like that. It takes about two or three days in order for it to actually break down. Then you just pour it on, pour it back into your container. You'll have clear, and then just top it off with a little extra. All I do is I just try to use it all up until there's nothing left. Saves you a little money that way, and it lasts and lasts. All right, it's still Corona time. Forgive the hair. I can't help it. It's just the way my hair grows. It looks like I have an old butt cut. Some of you know what that is. Some of you don't. But anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment any questions or anything like that i'll be more than happy to get back to you hit the like button i don't care what you do just do one of those that's all i ask see you guys in the next video this video i'm gonna paint this guy right here as you can see it's already finished but i've already done the recording hi brad twilly today i'm painting a japanese lantern